Under the Bell is brought to you by Lee Cossell and Crowley, attorneys in law. Let's welcome in Brian Martin from Los Angeles with our After the Bell report. And Brian, I understand new IRS tax rules mean your paycheck could be a little bit bigger next year, which I think is a good thing. Yeah, indeed, Phil and Alexis. Blame inflation for this one. The IRS will adjust tax brackets for 2023, meaning you could get more take-home pay throughout the year. More of your 2023 wages will be subjected to lower tax rates than they were this year. You may also be able to deduct more income from your taxes. Now, the tax brackets will change. The standard deduction at tax time also goes up about 8%. But again, this will start in January. So don't expect any big tax payday, at least until tax time in 2024. On the markets today, another down day. The Dow fell today 99 points. President Biden says the U.S. will sell off 15 million barrels of crude oil from the nation's emergency supply. This is a plan to help lower gas prices, and it comes right ahead of the upcoming midterm elections. It also comes two weeks after the OPEC Plus group decided to cut oil production. BMW says it'll invest $1.7 billion here in the U.S. to make electric vehicles. Now, that includes a billion dollars to build EVs at the carmaker's South Carolina plant and another $700 million for a new battery facility in that same state. BMW says... Plans to make and sell at least six fully electric models in the U.S. by the year 2030. Reporting live, I'm Brian Martin. Phil and Alexis, back to you. All right, good stuff, Brian. Hey, before we let you go, more stores, I understand, Brian, are saying they'll be closed on Thanksgiving. Yeah, Walmart, Target, Best Buy, just some of the ones coming out today saying we are shutting our doors on Thanksgiving Day. A lot of companies started doing this, you'll recall, during the pandemic. Now, since so many of these big chains now also have websites, they're really not as reliant on specific days, parentheses, Black Friday, in order to really drive sales anymore. Walmart's CEO even says, quote, it's a thing of the past. He says their stores will be closed on Thanksgiving for good. Hmm. Oh, my goodness. Well, at least more family time. That's a good point. But there's always that thing that True you indeed. forget that you need to go get <laughs> sometimes, which I'm usually in that category. <laughs> so going to have to wait till the next day. Open, right. You're going to have to, I guess you're going to have to wait. All right, Brian, thank you very much. We'll see you tomorrow, sir.